New at six, families could be breaking the law and not even know it this 4th of July. 41 Action News reporter Josh Helmuth is live with the rules that surprised people across the metro. Red X fireworks here in the Northland has been, dare I say, booming today, along with the great weather, low prices, a great economy, just a few of the factors people attribute to the possible record-breaking sales in Missouri this year. But as we found out, as we proved, some people, when buying their fireworks, need to be extra careful where they shoot them off after they leave the tent. At over 10,000 square feet, Zeke Young may sell more fireworks in the metro than anyone. I think a lot of people are taking the day off, so we're expecting a big day today and tomorrow. You know, the weather, I think it's going to cooperate with us. But this Riverside tent isn't an exception. We visited several area fireworks tents. This one in KCK has been relatively busy, but they expect to make most of their money in the next 24 hours. It also appears to be a hot spot for those in nearby cities where fireworks are illegal. Well, Missouri is actually, you know, literally down the street, so people get confused. This customer is spending over $100 in fireworks. We like the big stuff that blows up, so. He also lives in Raytown. Hopefully have some relatives in the area that live outside of Raytown, because according to Raytown, no bottle rockets, missiles, sky lanterns, or Roman candles. Okay. This customer lives in KC Mo off Warnell. All fireworks in KC Mo are illegal. Really? You can't even have them. You didn't know that? No. <laughs> And this family getting their annual fireworks fix. Just the essential smoke bombs oh. and yeah, just, the essentials. Yeah, the essentials. Yeah. <laughs> They're from Brookside. Did you know that in KC Mo all fireworks are illegal? Yes. I mean, we try and keep it to the, the simple stuff. According to the Missouri Department of Revenue, there were over 1,400 fireworks dealers in Missouri last year, generating over $40 million in sales. And considering fireworks are illegal in KC Mo, Johnson County, and in some neighboring states, dealers who do operate in the KC Metro find themselves a magnetic hotbed for pyromaniacs every July 3rd. You guys just use good common sense and good safety. Now, even if you do purchase fireworks this year and you can legally shoot them off in your city, there's usually only specific times you can legally shoot them off. So be sure to check out the fireworks guide on our website at KSHB.com to see times when you're legally allowed to shoot those off. In the Northland, Josh Helmuth, 41 Action News. Well, as Josh just said, if you have questions about the fireworks and if they're legal in your neighborhood, your area, we do have your back. We've broken down where it is legal and illegal. It's a very good list. It's at KSHB.com.